Hey, why is the sky blue? Have you ever looked up at the sky on a clear day and wondered why it's blue? You might think it's because there's water in the air, but that's not true. Water vapor actually makes the sky look more like this. This is what the sky looks like without any atmosphere at all. So what really makes the sky blue? To answer this question, we need to go back to school and learn a little bit about light. When we shine a light through a prism, we can split white light into a rainbow of colors. The reason this happens is because each color of light has a different wavelength. Red light has the longest wavelength, while blue and violet light have the shortest wavelengths. When light waves hit the molecules in our atmosphere, they bounce and scatter in all directions. Blue and violet light are scattered more than other colors because they have shorter wavelengths. This is called Rayleigh scattering. So if blue and violet light are scattered more, why is the sky blue and not violet? Well, it's because our eyes are more sensitive to blue light than violet. If you were to take a piece of paper outside, you could see that it would appear blue under a clear sky. This is because your eyes are seeing the blue light that is being scattered from the paper. But what makes some days the sky a darker blue than others? It's all about how much water vapor is in the air. On a humid day, there is more water vapor in the air, which means that more light is being scattered by those molecules. This makes the sky appear darker blue. So the next time you look up at the sky, remember that you're actually seeing light that has been scattered by molecules in the atmosphere. And the reason that light is blue is because blue light has a shorter wavelength than other colors, so it gets scattered more. Thanks for watching till the end, and I'll see you in the next video.